Hey YouTube, you ever have this problem where your cork is just a little too narrow and you put on the mouthpiece and something like this happens? And I need to be right here to be in tune, but you know, it drops. So now I'm just really, really sharp. So here's how to fix that. Some people use a lighter, but I don't like doing that. I don't like the idea of that because you know, I don't want to burn my stuff. I don't want my cork all black and then my just my cork just gets all hard and gross and crusty. Check me out. Tear off a piece of paper. It's not too long. Um, this is just a piece of sheet music. And then you're gonna wrap it around like this. And then check this out. Put it over and boom. Look at that. I can pull way further out. It doesn't move, it doesn't budge. I can push it in, and now I'm about right here to be in tune. Now, I actually do this every time I shed classical. My jazz mouthpiece is the reason why my cork is so compressed. And, you know, I, I can't get a new cork every time I practice classical. You know, that would be really expensive, and uh, a lot of time would be wasted. So I do this every time I shed classical. It doesn't have any influence on your sound. Sometimes it makes it better because it seals better. And, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching, and I'm less than 50 subscribers away from a thousand. That is amazing. Thank you guys. I'll make more videos soon. The semester started back up, and I'm getting a microphone finally. Uh, I don't know how good it's going to be, but it's definitely the best one I've ever had so far. So let's let's hope that works. It's coming in the mail soon. So all right.